Welcome to this week's update on the hedged option portfolio. Since the previous update last Friday, Bitcoin has held the level reached at the end of last week. This sideways chop we've had for the last few days is perfect for selling the short dated options, so I'd certainly be fine with another week or two of this. The equity is up slightly since Friday. The short term put selling has brought in a decent amount, but the longer dated vol has come down a little bit, reducing the value of the cover in June. Any value that remained in the 27th of September puts that I've been holding for a couple of months has also decayed away. The net result of all of this has been a slightly positive week so far. The account is now up about 10% overall, just under 1% for the week. The short 60k call is still open on the 4th of October expiry, and is quite deep in the money at the moment, of course. I'm continuing to sell puts each day, and at the moment they're all expiring out of the money, thanks to a lack of any meaningful pullbacks. I'm already short puts for tomorrow, which I entered yesterday afternoon. So let's short some more puts for the 27th, which is the big quarterly expiry. This quarterly expiry is currently the highest OI expiry, meaning it has the most open interest. After that expires, it will be the December quarterly with the most uh, open interest. So let's go to the 27th and open up some more short puts. Actually, I'll split this up. Try and get filled in the middle if we can. You can see the price is moving down slightly at the moment, so hopefully these will get fill. You can see the price increasing now which is making our offers for puts less attractive. So we might have to get slightly more aggressive here if we want to fill. Going to be patient for now and I'll get more aggressive if it keeps going up. This is a good example at the moment of the cost of trying to get filled at better prices. If we just crossed the spread, we'd be in both of these positions and they'd both be, both be in a profit at the moment. Uh, but because we're waiting for better prices, being patient, um, the price has moved away and we do risk not getting a fill anywhere near those prices. Okay, I've given that a bit of time now. Price isn't really coming back down. So time to adjust these orders. In fact, I'm going to cancel this order and sell two of the 63s instead. So we can just cancel that, change this to about mark price up this quantity to 0 0.2 and there we go. So I'm now short puts on the 26th and the 27th. The delta is about zero at the moment, uh, but we've got a nice amount of theta that we're holding. That's it for today's video. Just a quick update. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.